just up and coming, and that's mm -hmm. always good to see. He has a cloud, he has secondary MK and also Bayonetta, but we are just gonna get Bayo versus Cloud on Town and City, a stage both of them can profit a hell of a lot of. Mm -hmm. There we go, starting a match with, us, with like the, real shot. <laughs> <laughs> the real shot as indeed. Right. And from what I recall, these two actually go pretty even just because they've played so much. Mm -hmm. But we might be proven wrong here, I'm curious to see. Good ledge net with the OB there by Ezreal to just uh, stay out of any potential trouble. But this pressure by Butter. Yeah, Butter is not allowing any stage control for Ezreal here. However, playing a character with a sword that big, you eventually lose some of the stage control. And you lose, in this case, most of the stage control. Yeah, and wow, he just <laughs> normal get him into Witch Twist does not respect Ezreal at all on the ledge. What a Ooh. random finishing touch. And that's something Ezreal is known for, but Butter was too low percentage yeah, to kill. But and I not enough rage either. Yeah, but I do respect the attempt. Mm -hmm. It was that definitely an interesting, interesting attempt. It's certainly a wake-up call for Butter, right? Like, you have openings and I'm aware of them. Yeah, exactly. Just don't press these random buttons or you will get punished. And that fair one is so good on the shield. It's ridiculous. And the real shot is forcing him to use the, <laughs> the up D there early. And these are the percentages both of them need to be very careful at. Of course, Azrael needs to be careful for the random witch time, and mm -hmm. Butter needs to be careful for basically every cloud move. <laughs> Charging up yeah. that limit whilst Butter is off stage. Very good play, and also very good SVI there. SVIing downwards so that the side B could not connect. Mm -hmm. but, but so far, both, both these players are surviving each other. That it's, it's up throw. Nah, no, almost pro proper DI from Butter here. Like, however, the next one actually might take it. Or but that dash attack on the ledge takes it, and Butter looks at the sky like, why did I get hit by that? <laughs> but yeah, dash attack is not, a it's not a nice attack if you get hit by it, of course. No, definitely not. But now here we go, Astriel with the lead. Let's see if he can get any merit off of it. Mm -hmm. Like that, that rage, that rage is looking really valuable right now. Dude. Definitely, an earlier B gets him scot free out of that situation once again. But I should definitely take note because that's the second time he has done that already. But that back air across stage will take the cake, and that is even stocks in this first game. Yeah, and just some, some. <laughs> Very patient play for both players. Well, Butter is more on the chase, whereas Ezreal is trying to get his limit up, but this is a very hairy situation. Oh, actually, he was good attack. Yeah, that was very good awareness by Ezreal, because that was very, very scary. There we go, Butter gets one hit, and then he's like a shark that smells blood. He will just Ooh. keep on going, and that might be... Oh, no! That was not the conversion I was expecting. Gotta use up the limit there. Yeah, this is looking really difficult for Ezreal because Butter just has all the momentum, but now it shifts, landing that back air. If it goes like the first stocks, they actually so far for quite a bit longer, allowing Ezreal to get that limit again. Yeah, exactly, and that, that's what we see right here. He just he plays a very patient neutral, and once he gets the time, he will just charge his limit a little bit, walk back, space it back air, charge some more limit. It just feels. Very optimal, and wow, just these random forward and up smash takes like, it. He doesn't, he, he doesn't actually need the limit. He, he, no. uh, he still has plenty of other tools. He to needs that off. golf swing, just four and just... The Tiger Woods. Yeah, <laughs> hits him off into the blast zone up. Mm -hmm. And I mean, that's what Town City is for, killing early off the top. Yeah, so it just worked a bit more in favor of Asriel than it did for, for Butter here. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah, so, something, something, something you notice as well, like... Uh, constantly, uh, yeah, Ezreal is constantly actually SDIing out of yeah. all these uh, up B combo attempts from Butter. Yes, SDI is very clean, and it seems like Butter does not really have a good read as to what SDI Ezreal will use. Because mm -hmm. I know Butter is a player that reads other people's SDI or tries to react to it, mm -hmm. but it seems like he's not quite there yet with Ezreal, which is of course very, very positive for him. But here we go, back to town and city. And I mean, we saw that Butter could do it that game. It was just mm -hmm. that Ezreal managed to clutch it out twice. Ooh, actually giving, giving it just a little boost to Ezreal to make it back to the stage. Yeah. Right? And it seems like Ezreal really has 
Ooh, is that going to be yeah. the kill? Yeah, it is. This time he makes the right read. Yeah, he reads the SDI this time, and that is a very early kill and a very difficult looking match for Ezreal already. Oh, and that's the jump gone, and that is the kill! <laughs> Butter there. going all Those in were 28 there. seconds. Yeah, that was a very, a very quick match. Wow. I saw that fair one hitting the jump, and I was like, "This might be over," it and it over. was. Like this is this this is something similar like this has happened earlier yeah. to Asriel, if you remember correctly. At, I, um, when at Fortuna. Oh, right. against Isodian. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It was gone before you know it. However, this is only one stock. That, those were two stocks. That, those were gone. <laughs> yeah. like insanely quick. Oh, are we gonna see a switch? W what is this? Are we? Oh, wait, oh, the skin. Okay, skin yeah. switch. I get it. I get it. We're going to Dreamland. Asriel actually, actually, actually put thoughts in the skins, why he's using the skin, like... Oh, really? I, yeah, it might be some me memento, like, okay, if I play this skin, I'm supposed to do this more, like, something to keep in the back of his head. I think he just wants to attain maximum edge, knowing him. <laughs> also bad, but there, there, if I remember correctly, he had some reasons to play skins, like... Oh, fair enough, fair enough. Not going too deep in them, but still, just small things. The little things. It's, it's what yeah, the little things. That was some very nice shield pressure there on the platform by Asriel. And he's just playing neutral very patiently, but as we saw, Mother just needs one opening. And as I already mentioned, he goes as a shark that has smelled blood. He just goes right in, takes use of all the advantages that he can get. But right now, it looks like Azrael has all the stage control in the world. However, he aims that limit cross dice the wrong way, putting him in this sticky situation. But he that was a very nice reverse a B. Very, very nice. And I know that the the, the be biggest tip as one as a cloud player has given Asriel earlier this year yeah. was to improve his recovery game. Mm -hmm. Because Asriel already was like very good when it came to advantage state and combos. Mm -hmm. But once it came to recovering, he was very lackluster according to S1. But he has definitely uh, worked on it. Because we have seen him evade Butter's ledge trap multiple times already in this set. However, that last game, of course, was a bit unfortunate. As was yeah. that side B mm -hmm. to a pair conversion. Butter I mean. is, is switching it up a bit more compared to the first game. And he, he actually is uh, getting these kills at the top right now. Yeah. Even, even though this is not even Town City, he's still getting them. Oh yeah, but I mean, Dreamland is just like also a pretty good stage to kill off the top. It's just normal, but because of those platforms, you can get earlier kills. And now he scouts out the early limits. Ooh, Ooh and he reads the, the air now. dodge. That was almost Ooh. again a very quick second stock. But this is this is what SDI can net you. Yeah, exactly. It can net you the kill, and that's certainly what Asriel was looking for. But those bullets. A limit is on deck, so he's yeah, he is gonna safe. make it back. Hi again. I don't know, man. Like, Butter was ready this time, but Astro almost gave it to him. Falling out of the normal cross dash, I was about to say limit. Just get, I'm yeah, just that's also that. SDI ball, but mm -hmm. it is very difficult to SDI. We saw it in Mundo's uh, compilation that it's SDI ball. Oh, we did? I, I haven't seen you that. You haven't probably. seen it yet? No. That, that's, that's something you should do. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait, I did see that with the Ness up there, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, never mind, never mind. I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Butter is just really trying to wall him out with Beckers and Azrael being on the back foot, he needs to be so careful where he plays every single move. <laughs> that was Limit actually safe. Probably safe. Yeah, probably, there. but no saving him from that Becker, mm -hmm. and that is going to be the set. 2-1 to Butter, a good comeback. Well done, Butter. Yes, very well done.